Hey, it's Mark. In this video, I'm going to show you how to turn on Chrome OS developer mode. So it's kind of like unrooting your Android phone where you can have like a PC type experience on a Chromebook. You can install apps that aren't in the Play Store. The drawbacks of this are you're going to have lose all sorts of security. You can really mess up the Chromebook if you do things wrong. You know, there's no guarantees by Google that things will work as intended. But I'll walk you through how to do this. I'll demonstrate it looking over my shoulder right here on the Chromebook. And if this is for you, I hope this video is helpful. So this, you're going outside of the normal bounds of a Chromebook if you want to install apps that aren't in the Google Play Store, for example. So to do that, you hold the Escape key and the Refresh key there, and then you press the Power button like that. Press the Power button. So your screen's going to go black. Um, it's kind of restarting your system. It's going to take a minute. We'll wait till it reboots. Okay, and so this is what your screen will look like. It'll say the Chrome operating system is missing or damaged. So what you do next is you press the Control key and the D key at the same time, like that, and then Enter. Okay, and then that's what your screen will look like. It says turn Operated system verification off, press enter. So you press enter on the keyboard right there. So now it's going to reboot again. So now the verification is off. So you can just click enter. Now it's going to restart again after you've pressed enter. All right, now it says your system is transitioning to developer mode, your local data has been cleared. So just be aware that you're gonna wipe the data clean from your Chromebook when you enter developer mode. And it also says the system is not supported by Google. Um, so just be careful what you install on here. You're kinda going rogue, doing your own thing. You can see up top here, it says it's gonna restart your computer in about 30 seconds. Okay, so it took about four minutes for the thing to restart. There's a timer that shows you up there, and then your computer is going to restart, and you'll now be in developer mode. So it says the OS verification is off on there. Then you're going to hit enter again. All right, so then your Chromebook is going to start back up again. It says, welcome to your Chromebook. I'm now in developer mode. Okay, so you're going to connect to your Wi-Fi again. You're going to go through the normal setup process, um, but you're going to be in developer mode this time. All right, so once you've gone through that setup process, it probably took like 10 minutes. Um, you'll, you'll be in this screen. It'll say, welcome to your Chromebook. And it looks just like it did before, as if you weren't even in developer mode at all. So to know you're in developer mode, it'll say that your OS verification is off, the operating system. If you want to re-enable it, you'll hit the space bar. So now it says press enter and you wish to turn OS verification on. And this will get you out of developer mode and back to the normal mode. So now we're back out of developer mode and you're machine's going to reboot and you'll just be back in the safe normal Chromebook mode. So once you're out of developer mode, you'll have to go through the same setup process all over again. I hope this video is helpful for you and you're now able to go into your developer mode on the Chrome operating system. Do whatever you like in there. It's up to you. Remember, there's no security in there, so be careful. And if you like this video, give us a like and subscribe to our channel and we'll see you again soon.